Yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. It's cracking, people. It's, uh, so this is a first. It's February 29th. First time I've done this video um, on this date or done a video on this date since I've lived up here because I've only been up here for one other leap year. Or no, maybe, yeah, two others. Anyway, <laughs> but I haven't done any videos on February 29th, so this is pretty cool. And it looked like we're on fire back here, so I wanted to drive back here just to see what's going on because um, it looked like a lot of smoke. So, but anyway, this is the calm before the storm. Anyway, we're expecting about up to six inches and windy. So it could be cool for a minute. We could get some blizzard conditions if the snow's coming down at a decent rate while we have some of these strong um, sustained winds. So we'll see, we'll see, that could be cool. As I said, we're not expecting much snow at all. Um, you, you, you know, three to six inches total. But I think it's gonna be on the three inch side. It's just, I'm just, you know, I'm just going by what is typical. But look at this, look at how just hazy and, and smoggy and foggy or smoky it is over here. What is going on? That's not my windshield. As far as you know. How you guys doing? Um, yeah. <laughs> so funny. I get I get nervous still sometimes. But anyway. Yeah, there's Bear Mountain. There's Geronimo, the big run on the top right there. all these people coming back from a good time coming back from a good time visiting bear mountain my friend look at all these people leaving it all at once thank goodness we're going this direction so you know what i thought i would take you guys up here to show you guys a really killer sledding spot so follow me this is for those of you who at least stayed in the video for two minutes <laughs> i know it's a lot to ask when it comes to this guy two minutes with me dude it's either the time of your life or the worst time of your life <laughs> seriously um anyway oh gosh i'm in a really great mood i'm in a terrific mood i've gone through quite quite a bit this past month or two month and a half um a lot a lot more than i'd uh, like to uh to fess up about but you guys know how i am i always i always confess so anyway Look at how beautiful that looks. Look at how beautiful that looks. Okay. There we go. So we're gonna go to the right here, okay? We're gonna stay to the right. So you wanna stay to the right to go up to this sledding area, but we're gonna video bear while we're driving up here. So this is the sledding spot guys you got to go all the way up to the top where it dead ends at an off-roading area called the 2N10 I don't know why I had to pan over here the 2N10 all right so here we go oh and hey Matthew Lund I want all of you to check out Matthew Lund's channel um, I've mentioned him before he's he's one of us here just seems like a super super cool cat family man the dude's been through a lot you guys like like oh my god like a lot I just, I'm telling you, just crazy, crazy stuff. Um, but anyway, we're going to turn around right here. But yeah, Matthew Lawn. Um, ah, shit, man. You know what? Ah, why do I always forget these names? You guys, like, it's nothing personal. I just have smoked myself stupid over the years, man. I, I can't remember. I suffer from CRS. Um, can't remember. Beep. So this is where you would come up and sled. And you'll be able to sled up here for sure after this storm. There'll be a lot more snow up here than just right down here. Pretty amazing. Um, we're right up against the mountain right here. So, uh, yeah. Um, 
anyway, gosh, dude, Matt, I'm sorry, bro. I can't remember the name of your damn channel at the moment. You know what I'll do? I'm going to pull over right now and check it out. And then I'm going to stop the video and start a new one. It's Hang on, guys. K M P Explorations. Capital K, capital M, capital P Explorations. And I think it's uh, capital E and then Explorations. <laughs> but K M P Explorations, he's a cool dude, you guys. He is one of us here, um, um, one of the friends here. Um, one of you guys, man. So I love helping you guys whenever I possibly can. You guys are so awesome. And uh, I'm just, yeah, I, and he's a super cool cat. As I said, been through a lot, lives in, in England. His town is completely flooded. He can't see his mom till like March 12th or 13th or something until they uh, reopen those, those roads. I mean, it's just insane. Poor guy's been through a lot. So um, yeah, if you guys can give him a little bit of love, that would be great. Give him a little bit of love and uh, maybe sub up to his channel and check it out. Um, it's a lot of like abandoned building stuff and just just like really cool stuff like that, man. Like, like it's really captivating. So anyway, here's Bear, you guys. Take care, Matt. I hope you and your family are good, dude. It was nice chatting with you. <clears throat> um, all right, so we're at Bear Mountain right now. That's a nice, that's right, they changed the color. That's right. Let's see here. The latest, uh... Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, guys. I love it here. I absolutely love it here, especially when we get this type of weather. Like coming the way that that is coming, he's just a calming one. Loud. Um, let's see here. Let's see here, man. You know what? The, seriously, like I swear, you guys, I need to start writing stuff down. I forget a lot, and I am super, super sorry. There are a few of you who want me to. To, to shout you out. And dude, I'd be so happy to do that. It's no it's like awesome to do that. I, and I I can't remember who. So I, I need I need to write it down. Please remind me. And then when you see me, you know. Just let me know. <laughs> so funny. So you know what? Um what was I gonna say? Yeah, so regarding the snow, you guys it's not going to be much and it's going to be gone quick. It's I, I'd, I'd be willing to bet two days, maybe a day and a half after it's done, it'll all be gone. I sure hope I'm wrong, but my knowledge is strong after I've hit the bomb. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. I was just trying to make a rhyme. Gosh, jeez. Okay. Um, let's see. Yeah, look at that. Does that look like smoke? What the heck is going on? That, that is smoke, dude. What the hell? Dude, what is going on here, dude? It, it, dude, it's totally smoke. Something's on fire. I can smell it now. Oh my God, dude. That's gnarly, you guys. Gnarly. It might be a controlled burn then. I hope because the California fire people are right here, but of course they'd be here. There's a fire. <laughs> Seriously. Dude, that is no bueno. Where is that, man? I bet one of their little controlled burns got out of control. Man. Because it's so windy today. Like, why would they have done that on a day that the storm's approaching? It just doesn't make any sense. But... I don't know what the hell I'm even talking about when it comes to, to these guys. These guys are freaking, these guys are freaking angels, man. They save our ass so much up here. Without them, we'd already all be gone. But yeah, that's amazing. And it smells so good though. It smells like a, a fire. Well, like a fireplace fire. It smells really good. 
Alright, that looked like Hoist Gracie, but it wasn't. Thanks, brother. I knew I saw smoke. I knew I wasn't, I didn't smoke too much. I was like, geez, did I just exhale? Hey guys, I'm just kidding. I, I'm, in, I'm in a really, I'm in a really good place right now. And you know what it is? It's because for the first time ever, I accidentally left my cell phone um, not near me while I was asleep. And then I slept way through my opening hours of work today and was in an absolute blind panic when I woke up. But. Uh, it all worked out. Yeah, I lost some business today, but um, one time in two and a half years, dude, it can happen. So, and hopefully March 10th on my birthday, I'm gonna take some time off. But I, you, you guys know I won't, even though I, I, I could go skiing. And it might snow then too, that'd be pretty cool. Anyway, I love you guys a lot. Get ready for the snow that's coming. Get your asses up here ASAP, uh, because it, it could be extremely treacherous driving up. Um, I'm saying blizzard conditions driving up, dude, once it starts snowing, because you're going to get some crazy winds right there. So anyway, peace out, you guys. Talk to you guys later.